children today's topic of bal sanskar class is holi holi is an auspicious festival of our indian culture it is an opportunity to show mutual love and harmony by eradicating discrimination holi is not just a festival of burning a pile of firewood but along with it it is also an auspicious day to remove the weakness of the mind and to burn away unwanted evil desires of the mind holi is the festival of receiving goodness holi is the festival of spreading the message of affection in the society pooja baba ji says holi is meant to get rid of your lethargy and phlegm that has accumulated in the last season if you do not do any physical activity on this festival then you will become lazy and lethargic and phlegm will not get its way to move out from your body the day of holi gives a message of unity by removing the notion of mine and yours that all this land belongs to gopal and all living beings are shiva's form one and all and all in one the rich are looking for happiness and the poor also strive happiness so enjoy holi on this day as described by our saints that's why it is said that if you want to play holi then play it as described by the saints let's start today's bal sanskar class by remembering pooja babu ji children now all the children will recite the mantra while touching the place of tilak with the ring finger om ganapate Now all the children will do a unique experiment to concentrate the mind and remove the restlessness of the mind. Thank with ya. Take a deep breath through both the nostrils and hold for some time. Now releasing the breath, do the japa of om without opening the mouth with your head moving up and down in a manner that it gives pressure on the larynx. The process should be continued till the breath is completely exhaled it can be practiced twice or thrice benefits the lung capacity and immunity power is enhanced by this experiment diseases related to thyroid are cured japa and meditation done after this exercise provides extra benefits it opens the door of ida and pingala nerves and awakens sushumna nerves as also the vishuddhakya kendra Now we will chant and praise Lord Ganpati. Nati tarati bhi karam navodi tark bhaswaram. Namat surari nirjaram nata dhika padu dharam. Sureshwaram nidhi shwaram gaje shwaram gane shwaram. Maheshwaram tamashrae parat param nirantaram One who always shines like the new sun who assumes a fierce form for the proud who's worshiped by the gods and the one who never grows old who removes the obstacles of the surrendered O Sureshwar we take shelter of Gajeshwar Ganeshwar Maheshwar with our mind and intellect now all the children will chant om hari
children now we will all do thratak thratak increases our concentration and memory power Thank you. 
time for story now. Children, the title of today's story is The Festival of Holi Reminds of Devotee Prahlad. Prahlad means what? The one keeps his mind happy even in the face of obstacles, diseases, grief, fear and sorrow. His name is Prahlad. One day, Rina Kashyapu called Prahlad and said, you say that God is everywhere. So give the introduction of your God. Prahlad said, Who should I introduce you? My God is everywhere. That supreme soul is the sustainer of all the living beings. The one resides in all men and women. His name is Narayan. Father, you also go to the shelter of the same Narayan. Small mouth and big talk. Where is your Narayan? If your Narayan is in everyone, then is it also in this hot pole? Yes, Father. Well, your Narayan is pervading even in this fire-heated pillar. Your Narayan is in everyone. So embrace this hot pillar. If he is in it, then he'll protect you. Prahlad had done penance in the previous birth and got Naraji's satsang during pregnancy. He had loyalty to God. As soon as Prahlad embraced the pillar with firm faith, the pillar broke and Lord Narsimha appeared. Narsimha means half human, half lion. God had to take the form of Narsimha to kill Hrina Kashyap because he had done penance and taken a boon from Brahmaji that I will neither die from humans nor from animals. I will die neither from God nor from demons, neither above nor below, neither inside the house nor outside. I will not die by weapons. Lord Narsimha said to Rana Kashyap, even with all your boons secured, your death is inevitable. Now I will send you to your home. In the evening, the Lord made Rana Kashyap, who was troubling Bhaktaraj Prahlad, sit on his lap on the threshold of the door and skill him in his sharp nails. Even then, God's anger did not calm him. The deities praised him to pacify the angry Lord Narsimha. But Lord Narsimha, incarnated with passion, was not satisfied even with the praise of the gods. Then the deities played a trick and put Prahlad in front. Seeing his beloved devotee, the anger of the Lord calmed down. He took Prahlad in his lap and loved him very much. If the creatures love God, then God also loved the creature back. So see children, this story teaches us that no matter however difficult the situation may be, still, like Prahlad, we should have faith in God and Guru. Your faith and belief should be kept firm. Glory of Indian Culture Scientific Reason for Holy Dahan Due to the change of season during Holi, phlegm in the body melts and enters the gastric fire due to which many diseases occur. To melt this phlegm, we celebrate Holika Dahan as phlegm is destroyed by this extreme heat and on the second day we jump and play dhulandi which again helps melt the phlegm. This protects us from many dangerous diseases. Holika dahan should be done with cow dung tubers or cow dung cakes because by burning only 2 kg of dry desi cow dung cakes, 60% that is 300 grams of oxygen is released. Scientists have researched that a ton of oxygen is produced when a cow's pot is smoked with cow's ghee and the next day dhulandi should be played with the color of palash which prevents diseases caused by heat in the coming days. Spiritual reason is also there for celebrating Holi. This festival gives the message that one who has devotion is always victorious. No evil intentions harbored by anyone can harm one, him or her, the one who has devotion. Festival Special Playing Holi with Palash Flowers Pucha Babaji says, Playing Holi with chemical colors available in the market has very harmful effects. It affects the skin and eyesight very badly. If you want to protect your health, 
Avoid chemical colors and play holy with palash flowers. The color of palash flowers increases the immunity power, balances the seven basic elements of our body. After holy, the sun's rays fall straight. Due to the heat, Sapdhatu becomes unbalanced. But by playing holy with palash flowers, our immunity increases. The seven elements remain balanced and one remains healthy. Color made from palash flowers is available at ashram Sat Sahitya Kendras and main stores. Health Protection How to get the maximum health benefits in this month Food should be consumed without oil and ghee on the night of Holi. Mucus increases by eating spicy food. Food without ghee or oil will absorb cough and the digestive system will be fine. In this season, if you chew 15 to 20 soft leaves of neem with two black peppers every day for 15 to 20 days, your immunity will be protected throughout the year. If you eat salt-free food for 15 to 20 days, your mucus will remain balanced. One will not be fatigued or feel weak and the body remains healthy. Consuming sugarcane and eating bitter gourd is healthy in this season. Jumping is beneficial and the new grain which is called as hola should be consumed after offering to the Almighty. Doing Kirtan Yatra is specially beneficial. Panchkavya's Prasad which should be taken on the day of Poonam. This cures diseases even from the bones. Competition time. Now it's the turn of knowledge competition. You will be asked a question. There will be four options in the answer, given as answers and you have to give the correct answer in 10 seconds. The question is, who is the god or deity of Mahamrityunjaya Mantra? Options are Lord Brahma, Lord Vishnu, Shiv Bhagwan, or Sun God or Surya Bhagwan. The correct answer to the question will be told to you at the end of the session. Do's and don'ts. Do's and don'ts. Do's and don'ts as the examinations are close. Children, now the day of your examinations are very near. Do you know what should be done to excel with good marks on the days of the examination? Before reading, stabilize your mind in meditation for one minute. Keep both the hands on the knees in Gyan Mudra. Put your tongue out a little and sit in the meditation of God or Sadhguru for 1-2 to two minutes. Start studying by remembering Lord Surya Narayan, the Master of Wisdom, Lord Shiva, Mother Saraswati, Sadhguru, the giver of knowledge. Pay a lot of attention to what you read, think and calm down for a minute. This will help you remember what you read. Before you go for your exam, mix some curd or yogurt and sugar candy and eat it as prasad. This is considered a very auspicious omen. One should go out of the house only after applying tilak of saffron, turmeric lime mixture or basil root soil on the forehead. While giving the exam, first read all the questions in the question paper then start writing answers to those questions which seem easy. After writing the answers to the simple questions, then go to those which you find difficult and meditate because nothing is impossible to solve. Hari Om Ma, Hari Om Ma. By touching the place where Tilak is applied, Mother Saraswati, Lord Shiva, Ram Bhagwan, Sadguru Dev. Remember those who you have faith in. Om, Om, Om is the body of knowledge. Om. Om, 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 Om. This will give you courage. May my intellectual power develop. Difficult questions will also become easy to solve. Follow this strategy. Calm down for a minute. Very easy to follow strategy. Even the most difficult exams will prove to become easy for you. And you will excel with flying colors. Informative questions. What are the characteristics of an ideal student? Answer. Acting like a crow. 
meditating like a Huron, sleeping like a dog, consuming very little and observing celibacy are the five characteristics of a student. Just as a crow is so careful in every movement that no one can catch it quickly, a student should be careful about studying at all times. Every moment should be put to good use in acquiring, acquiring knowledge. Bhaktyan. Like a heron walking slowly in the water, its attention remains towards the fish. Similarly, while doing all the activities like eating and drinking etc., the student should keep his or her vision and attention towards the focus point only, which is your studies and education. Sleep like a dog. Just like a dog does not sleep peacefully, it wakes up after little sleep and rem remains alert even while sleeping. Similarly, a student should not sleep comfortably, luxuriously. One should not sleep properly and only from the point of view of health. Consume little. Consume food to satiate your hunger. But one should not overeat as it's unhealthy and only causes lethargy and makes one slow. Celibacy. Students should observe celibacy. Published from the Ashram Divya Prerna Prakash, Prerna Jyot means of health. Apne Rakshak Apne, Tugulab Okar Mehak etc. Should read a few pages of these books daily and try to lead your life accordingly. Activity time. Now all the children will stand one by one and also let everybody else know how you should celebrate the festival of Holi. The one who narrates well will be rewarded by the teacher. Yogasan Padangusthasan When the weight of the body comes only on the big toe, the asan is called as Padangusthasan. Children and youth must do this asan for the protection and upliftment of semen. Due to this, the brain remains healthy. The stability of the intellect and concentration is attained quickly. It is especially beneficial in the defects of dreams, diabetes, impotence, and semen defects. Method Sit on your toes, apply the heel of the left foot in the perineum, that is the space between the anus and the genitals. Keeping the fingers of both the hands on the ground, place the right foot on the left thigh. Balancing all the weight on the left sole, keep the hand in the posture of Namaskar. In the beginning, you can do it by taking the support for a few days. Keep the waist straight and the body stable. The vision should be concentrated on a point and the attention should be in maintaining balance. Do the same action by changing the leg. Time. In the beginning, do half a minute with both the legs. You can do this two to three times a day. But do not do it immediately after meals. Homework time. What is the benefit of playing holy with natural colors? What is the harm that is caused by playing holy with chemical colors? Write all your notes down and let's discuss it next class. Question air. Question number one. What message does the festival of holy give? Question number two. What is the metaphysical meaning of the name Pralad? Question number 3. What lesson can be learned from today's story? Question number 4. How should Holika Dahan be done? Question number 5. What are the health benefits of Holika Dahan? Question number 6. What are the health benefits of Dulandi? Question number 7. What kind of food should be eaten on the day of Holi? Question number 8. What should be done while giving the question paper in the examination? Narayan, Narayan, Narayan. With this, today's Balsanskar class ends. Children will meet again next week with a new knowledge enhancing topic. Till then, hurry home. Knowledge competition. The correct answer to the question is Lord Shiva is the deity of Mahamitan Jai Mantra. Chanting this mantra protects from premature death, accidents and etc.